general and particular solutions of a differential equation. In our earlier classes, we solved the equations of the type x plus 7 is equal to 0, x square minus 5x plus 6 is equal to 0, cos square x minus sin x is equal to 0, etc. Solutions of these equations are real numbers, complex numbers or angles which will satisfy the given equation. That is, when that number is substituted for the unknown x in the given equation, left hand side becomes equal to the right hand side. Now, consider the differential equation d square y by dx square plus y is equal to 0. The solution of this differential equation is a function phi that will satisfy it. That is, when the function phi is substituted for the unknown y in the given differential equation, left hand side becomes equal to right hand side. The curve y is equal to phi of x is called the solution curve of the given differential equation. Consider the function given by y is equal to phi of x is equal to a sin of x plus b, where a, b belongs to real numbers. When this function and its derivative are substituted in the equation d square y by dx square plus y is equal to 0, left hand side will become equal to right hand side. So, it is a solution of the differential equation d square y by dx square plus y is equal to 0. Let a and b be given some particular values, say a is equal to 2 and b is equal to pi by 4. Then we get a function y is equal to phi 1 of x is equal to 2 sin x plus pi by 4. When this function and its derivatives are substituted in the equation d square y by dx square plus y is equal to 0. Again, we observe that left hand side is equal to right hand side. Therefore, phi 1 is also a solution of the equation d square y by dx square plus y is equal to 0. Therefore, the function phi consists of two arbitrary constants a, b and it is called general solution of the given differential equation whereas function phi 1 contains no arbitrary constants but only the particular values of parameters a and b and hence it is called a particular solution of the given differential equation. That is, the solution which contains arbitrary constants is called the general solution of the differential equation and the solution obtained from the general solution by giving particular values to the arbitrary constants is called a particular solution of the differential equation.